Hey, round belong, 2018, episode 126. Aaron Hughes is Adam Garstang. We're back after a long spout of doing fuck all. Go on, Being down, ill. Being well, Ill. I was very ill. You had two weeks of ill, I had two yeah. weeks of ill. We, we swapped illness. Just I shit myself over Christmas. I didn't do that. I really did. I, I had that. He was uh, playing Resi 7. I had the um, chest infection. Oh yeah. Right, and I was I was drip, sweat was rolling down my face and off. Right, I had my uh, pajama bottoms on, some underwear, a vest, a t-shirt, a jumper, my nightgown, and I were in my covers, and it was just fucking rolling down sweat. But I was freezing cold and in pain, and I was sat there in bed watching something on the laptop. So I had to sit over here uncomfortable. That's I got. And then I was just sat there, didn't push, didn't want to fight or anything like that, and I just went, I've shit myself. Which was nice, that was yeah. my Christmas present to myself. Kept it warm though, mm. and he had plenty of layers on. Mm. Kept it in there. And then, uh, and then I, about half an hour later, I started vomiting everywhere, which was nice. Right. I had two fake. Mm. Took Coke all. Okay. Fucked me up. My brother rang me up on Sunday. This is over Christmas, so brother rang me up on Sunday, still on Coke all. Saw him um, on the Wednesday after Christmas. And he said, you sound like you're on smack. <laughs> Maybe it was smack. It's, Maybe smack well, apparently would have been better. It is. He, apparently, is it? Yeah, apparently. Oh, right. something like They're really, they go, really They got smack heads. Really, smack really heads powerful. Smack heads of the world. Well, there's a warning on the front of it. You can just buy them over the counter. Can you? Oh, sure. Sure you there you go. Get some smack from your local pharmacy. Maybe not boots. Actually, go boots. They might give you too much smack. Is that in focus? Uh, yes. Yeah. Can cause addiction for three days use only and they Wait. give you 32 tablets that's all right you know you can't have 32 tablets in three days so why give you more than three days worth of <laughs> <laughs> why get you dependent on them for next Mental. time you shit yourself mm, yeah well. anyway we're gonna abuse the news oh yes it's been a while it's been a while so i'm not doing all that shit but you know there's a lot of stuff we missed if you want to talk about anything that we've missed just put it in the comments and that's what we'll do but otherwise, you're just going to get the latest stuff-ish. Ish. House of the Not Dead. Oof! In my face! Have we got an image for this, Got an image Mr. for this. Man? There's a new House of the Dead game. Is it called House of the Dead? It's called Resident Evil 8. No, Eight. it's called uh, Scarlet's Dawn. Oh. Yeah. I present to you zombies. Exhibit A. Yeah, that's a shot of it. 2018, that's going to come out. Uh, <gasps> that's this year? That's this year. <laughs> that's weird, isn't it? Mm. Um, it's an arcade game. Deluxe sitting cabinet and a standard one. And will it come to consoles at some point? I don't fucking know. Probably not. Don't know? Well, they don't give you light guns anymore, so you have to play everything in VR. So unless they're going to chuck it onto VR... Use your Joy-Con, use your Move wand. VR might be alright. They'll try and put it in VR. If, if it's going to come out, they'll try and put it in VR, but you yeah. don't do like gun games anymore. Well, they are doing. No, consoles. They don't do arcade machines anymore. Well, but they, they are do. doing. They do. Yeah, be 3D. Um, I don't like the VR. sitting cabs for the gun game. There's one in uh, Blackburn Cinema. You want to stand up, really, don't you? And there's a sitting cab where you've got like a turret thing, mm. and apparently it checks your heart rate, uh, and then it like blows gusts of air with jump scares. It oh, right. blows you, and you're like, oh, no. but it's a it's bit 4D. It's a bit, <laughs> yeah, it's a bit, it's a bit crap though. It's it's one of them where you are getting hit. Yeah, it's okay. A good game. You're just getting hit, right, so no. put that money in. But yeah, spend that money. A uh, couple of quick and switch emulator announced. So that'll be happening at some point. It's the same people that did the 3DS emulator for your PC. For you know, your pucker. If you want to be like, is it illegal? Probably. It's if most you, certainly If you want to do that, you can do that if you want. Uh, Activision closes its only distribution center in the US. But... It's not really that interesting. They were speculating that it was going to be because they're planning on an old digital future, but that, no. They're just using third-party ones. Yeah, yeah, it would make sense. 
don't even worry about it. Yeah, they're out, so I said, that's it. Well, you know, if they're not releasing, if, if they're releasing one game a year, what's the point in run paying that distribution centre all year round? Hmm. Yeah, well, America's a big place, but just get some other fuckers to do it. No, that's Sometimes what I'm getting easier, at. Though. I know yeah. America's a big place, but if you've only got one game a year, like I say, you're paying for that 20 yeah, all the yeah. time. Because after the first three months, you're going to, well, after the first month, you're going to severely drop in what you're producing. I'd imagine so, so, yeah. There was a Nintendo Direct Mini. Did you watch that? No. They sort of stealth dropped it, but they didn't because everybody were rumouring about it. So I think they were sulking and they didn't announce it. Because everybody were rumouring about it anyway. Right. So it's like, oh, fuck it, have it. It was out. Yeah. Have it. Done. So, uh, quick run through that. Dark Souls, that's coming on the Switch and all formats as well. It's a re jigger me re jigger me do Yeah, the original one. So that's happening. No, the original one's Demon Souls. Oh, no, yeah, the first Dark yeah. Souls. Yeah. yeah. Even though the first Dark Souls is Demon Souls, so it's the second. It's a bit like Soul, Soul Edge was the arcade thing. Soul Blade was the console version right. of that game. Mm. And Soul Calibur is the second game. And then you've got Soul Calibur 2. Oh. Soul Calibur 3, 4. Even though yeah. Soul Calibur is technically the second game. And then you've probably got a gold edition and a game of the year edition to make it work. And a queef edition. <laughs> and a edition. special microtransaction edition. Winbox mm. edition. Uh, they are, so it's using the original assets. So if they're not doing that much with it, then I don't no, imagine. From, from software. They were, but... If the original assets were quite good anyway, up -rezzed. I don't know. I don't know. That's happening. People like dying. So, Mario Tennis Looks Aces. Good. That good. was good. The last one was pretty bare bones and dull. Was that the Smash one or was that the Wii? You, was the one on Free, the Wii? 3DS one. It, it just apparently there weren't much to it. Because we're many think, modes are out like that. We're thinking about doing um, Mario Smash Tennis on the GameCube or whatever it's called. And some of them are quite good for yeah. a tournament, but we're it's it's all a matter of are we doing a one on one match? Oh, are we only having one game? Mm. Are we having two? So we could go on. So it's, we're struggling to get that. So we might go for uh, uh, Mario <laughs> Smash. Soccer. Well, generally they're all right, mm. but I think the last yeah, one, three DS right, were right. a bit shit. Mm. Uh, but this one's got story mode. I don't think they've had one of them before. So do Not that. Asked. Do that, but yeah, it looks alright. Uh, Mario Odyssey's getting some free DLC uh, costumes and like an online mode where you hide a balloon. There, mm. whatever. It's like a little speed run thing. I'd said hide a balloon, not hide the sausage. Yeah. Uh, Hyrule Warriors Definitive Edition. Uh, that's coming to the Switch, which will have all the 3DS. DLC and the Wii U DLC and some new shit um, Breath of the Wild costumes, and not that much but you're getting everything so I think there was some DLC for the 3DS oh yeah, should check that out earlier no, we'll just but, randomly pick one <laughs> yeah um, yeah, so that's happening uh, Donkey Kong Tropical Freeze that's getting ported to the Switch with a, a different mode, Funky Kong is one of the characters you can be and he seems to be easier like it's because it's a fucking hard game i mean i really liked it mm. but it's hard and this is like well if you don't want to be stressed out play with him oh all right. he's quite cool well animated he's got a surfboard he can land on spikes and stuff that other characters. No, he just doesn't die as much he's just much easier he can yeah. infinitely sort of swim and do this spin thing and all these other little things that just make the game a lot easier because it's hard as fuck. It doesn't look hard as fuck, but it is hard as fuck. So that's happening. Mario plus Rabbids DLC, Donkey Kong. Don't think <coughs> it's a story <coughs> thing, but it's more. You pay for this one, though. <coughs> and <coughs> Kirby and The World Ends With You, which was a cult sort of 3DS rhythm sort of RPG was game. Right, Don't know, right, but right. apparently that's very popular mm. by small amount of people but yeah, about they love people. it a lot the eight <laughs> people who played that game real fucking like it and some other stuff but like I said Kirby that's always, there's always a new fucking Kirby here's another one yeah well I think I was surprised when E3 they announced one of the Kirby's and I'm like that actually looks really really pretty and then you went yeah this Kirby's coming out every other they're week they're you get yeah, about I'm like, oh, right, okay. you get at least two a year right. but maybe one now because it's not a 3DS one mm. but no actually there is some Kirby rumble bollocks Kirby Rumble Ballots. Yeah, for 3DS. Is, is that actually his second name? Yeah. Because he is pink and he looks like a bollock. He, he's a Rumble Ballock. He's a Rumble Ballock. HD Rumble Ballock. That's what he is. Bollock. 
uh, uh, player unknown battleground players demands region lock on China. Which is interesting because I think the last time we talked about this and China, they were on about making it, what were it? Socialist values in the Chinese version of the game. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Something weird like that. Well, it's nothing to do with that, but apparently the Chinese... Culture. Not all Chinese people, obviously. No, but just culturally. But culturally, uh, they're a bit more accepting of cheaters. So they cheat a lot online, whatever that is, mm. however you cheat online. But yeah, they yeah. do, right? So as soon as they opened the gates to, for Chinese players to play with everybody else, this is the gist I'm getting, mm. there was a fucking lot of cheating going on. Nobody was happy, a lot of complaints, a lot of... Mm. So, but they're not doing out about it. <laughs> it's quite cool. Uh, so that's that's yeah that's the thing. Um, just a lot of cheaters just magically that's, appeared overnight. Yeah. Oh, that's yeah. So they want it region locking. They want China to just be in their own little world. That's fucking, but that's racist. Yeah, that's what they said. They said in that's a world racist. where H and M just put a child in a hoodie and people get pissed off. They did, didn't they? They put they put a so they were a black kid, weren't they? And they put him in a, a some like. Monk, coolest someone, monkey in the jungle. Coolest monkey in the jungle. Do you know what I call children? I call children cheeky monkey, cheeky monkey. They do say cheeky monkeys, but if you're seeing that and it goes through all that process of going through everyone, you're going to think somebody's going to take offence to this, so maybe well, no. I'll just not bother. Maybe, maybe, <laughs> maybe you see, because I took it a different way. I took it the fact that doesn't that not tell you how non racially motivated that was? Oh, when, that, when yeah, yeah. The cameraman yeah. took that photograph. The lighting man no, was said there. Exactly that, yeah. Right? The the parents were there. They yeah. were like, all right, it's just, just yeah. and then it took one sensitive person going that like that. And now don't get me wrong, there'll be people going, Ooh, that could ooh, that could be yeah, mi but, misconstrued, but, but but I'm not taking it as racist because they released yeah, yeah. it as a fucking advert. No, you see an so, innocence in it. And, yeah. and, and, and the innocence is like, right, well it's just a thing we call kids thing. monkeys. Call yeah, but monkeys. surely someone would have gone, someone's Someone is going to take that wrong. Yeah. So let's just not do that. But yeah, I just think it's worse that H and M apologised. I just don't think they should have apologised. Should have gone. Yeah. No, I don't know what you're on about. <laughs> well, it's <laughs> like on. it looks. It sounds like it's you. That's a racist. It's yeah. a bit like you know um, when you go back to was it fucking Victorian times and stuff like that, where they used to hide fucking ankles and stuff like that. Oh, that's pornographic now. Yeah, only if you see it as pornograph. Uh, porn ankles are pretty sexy. Yeah, yeah but not all, sure about cankles, but then they started though. doing it with with legs. Like in America, they went really weird. They started doing it with legs on tables and stuff. Yeah. A little bit provocative. Mm. That it's like you brought that up. Nobody else thought that. You started thinking a table looks a bit fucking yeah, sexy. Oh, trouble. let's censor it. So it's usually the person who brings it up that's got the fucking issue more than anybody else very true very true we assume of others what we know of ourselves yes there is a bit of that going on uh twitch gets exclusive overwatch league broadcast right so you can watch that probably now instead on of twitch. watching this don't watch don't watch that though watch us i wouldn't be interested i don't know what's going on yeah i've, I've watched a bit and thought no it's one of them where i guess you have to be there you know, <laughs> be playing it. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Uh, Xbox is getting a do not disturb feature. Well, Have Xbox. you got access to this yet? I mean, um, I usually just, I've actually switched my online off. It's been off for ages, so nobody knows that I'm ever playing any game. Do you ever. have any issues with playing your games offline? Um, well, I don't know if they are actually offline, but according to anybody that would look at my profile, oh, right. I'm so, offline. So you can still go up Marketplace and Yeah, all I still that. do oh, all right. that, yeah. Okay, fair enough, right. yeah. Right, no. I'd um, probably shut down if I switched the internet off. Yeah, yeah, it's, it, it's next to a useless console when, when you turn turn it off. It's like, nah, even if you've got a disc in sometimes, I'd go, I'm not playing that, you know. I'm not on date all the time, so. But, um, yeah. but yeah, so Xbox, I don't know, I came home today and there was an update. Well, yeah, you had some problems, and didn't you? And it's got rid of all profiles from my console. It's done some fucking weird ass update, and it ha I had to reconnect to my internet. It was a bit, oh, oh, well animated. Mm. Like, oh, right, now connect, now pick your region, now choose your account. So I typed in my like, email address, I went, right, now pick a gamer tag name. I'm like, whoa, 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 <laughs> motherfucker. So I put in my other email address. Mm. There's two email addresses I've got attached to my, my Xbox account, and I've had my Xbox account for since 
the beginning of 360. So 10 years ago, 10 years I've had this account, 10 years. Still take money off me. I still get email receipts for anything that I purchase from mm. Microsoft. I type in that, nope. I had to log in using my phone number. That's fucking mental. I hope the Chinese. <clears throat> fucking Chinese. Uh, so uh, I don't know. They pro I think that this. Uh, mm. So they've, they've they've exited me from the preview program. Yeah. So I probably had it and didn't know. All oh, right. Yeah. So you haven't had a chance to check out. They've do not reset disturb. all of my fucking uh, dashboard and all of my color settings. Well, I think it was the difference between this and just clicking on. Well, I don't know what you do on xbox but you just xbox is just don't show you online yeah something like that on playstation that's what i've done so yeah. i just figured it's that so i'm thinking what's the difference i think the difference is you can still play online you can still play online on when, when you say that like, you're not online oh, it's right. just like your mates it, you know anybody of your friends it'll just you'll be like oh he's not playing online so i'm not sure what the point is <laughs> but maybe it's just well, I think what it does though. is, I think Do Not Disturb just stops your uh, your notifications popping he up for a short well. period of time. He said that as well, he said your messages and stuff will just disappear. Well, you see, because Xbox, as much as I do, actually, don't, I don't mind the user interface. I don't think it's as difficult as people make out. Um, even though, obviously, it's down to perfect. You know, if you don't have Your phones. experience may, may, may vary. Um, but um, if you go onto your notifications, you say, I don't want any notifications while I'm watching a video. And it goes... Right, turn that box in. Brilliant. So you watch a video, and I was watching uh, I bought a film, not bought a film, I rented a film a month ago called Martyrs, it were French subtitles. Oh. Somebody kept going, blip! Mm. Right all over the subtitles, right there, right above. <laughs> blip! Oh, look, Mean Machine's online. And then 20 minutes later, blip! Mean Machine's online. Ah, you've just updated. Blip, me machines changed the fucking game. Uh, and I'm like, I'm missing lines of dialogue here, and I told you not to show anything while I'm watching a fucking film. Watching YouTube does the same. So then, but the only other option is to turn them all off. And then you don't know when you've done it. Do you need subtitles in porn, though? Emmanuel has a very good story, I'll have you know. <laughs> right. Okay, HTC announces Vive, announces Vive Pro. Couldn't speak then. There it is. Look That's it. what it looks like. It looks like a cheap Chinese rip-off. Whoa, well, we're not. We're doing too much Chinese now. Well, do you not think that, like, right here, right? Chinese cheeky that. monkeys. Remember, uh, remember those cheap-ass LCD games you used to be able to get, where you put the cartridges in, mm. but they were not really cartridges; they're just different little LCD things. You're know, like the, um, you had the Konami Turtles game. No, oh, yeah. There's okay. a like, bop, 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 bop. Yeah, it was jump up and they were just static images that. Yeah, it weren't 60 frames per second. Well, it weren't anything. I reckon it looks like a cheap knockoff. Like, oh, I'll get this for kid. 70 games and you put them in top like that. And all it is is you just uh, backlit LCD screen like that. Oh. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah, that'd be a nice well, shit. Troll's headphones present, look terrible. Yeah, so you get your headphones built in. I'll, I'll go through <coughs> that. I saw some pictures of people with it on their head, and it yeah. doesn't look any better. Well, but like you said, but uh, you're in it. You're so in it. Doesn't it. matter. And if it looks good, and it sounds good, and it feels good, it's twice the resolution, if, if I remember correctly. I'll tell you what it is. I'll tell you exactly what it is. Go on then. Well, Hit me with some gaming. I knowledge. could have given you old numbers, but I can't be bothered. But it's 68 percent increase in pixels from the previous one. Wow. Was whatever. I'm guessing that's about 62 percent. The previous one was 78 percent less than this one what no 78 percent increase in this one all right pixels i'm gonna say those numbers don't add up <laughs> they're 68 percent uh, better than the last one and the last one was 78 percent worse than this one so. I, I, I was retro working yeah fucking it up uh intricate oh, i can't even say it integrated yeah integrated. high performance headphones with built-in amplifier <laughs> does that just not mean you can just turn it up wilder so it means it's got a volume control on it. All right, it just sounded cool when I read it first <laughs> time. Uh, dual microphones. Is that so you can annoy people in stereo if you're online? Yeah, but stereo wouldn't matter. Hello, hello. Yeah, because you had to be moving anyway. Well, it wouldn't matter because, yeah, it's there. It's static. Yeah. So one there means you can talk yeah. and it'll always pick you up but stereo doesn't ma make any sense well because when the knobhead who's playing call of duty has got music on mm. while he's playing you'll know where it is in his room mm. so when you send the swap team in they'll know 
How have you got that? No, I haven't got that. I was too old. I just remembered then yeah. as I was saying it. So, yeah, that happened. That check, happened. check more news on Show Me Games News on Facebook. Everything, check it out. Everything your there. heart would desire. Images of me in the nude on games. Um, in, in games. In games. In games. <laughs> Dual front facing cameras. Yeah. That What's means, that for? well, the other one just had I put one. AR question mark. The, 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 the other one just had one. So <laughs> when you were coming outside of... Sorry, the, AR. Uh, when, when you were coming out of the lighthouse field of view... Yeah. Uh, a grid started showing up. It starts yeah. off transparent. Oh, yeah, saying so right? don't walk in this but wall. It's all, it, it was weird because it's just one camera in the middle of your head. You haven't got binocular vision. Oh, right. So that'll oh. make it 3D. So then oh, you'll right. be able to reach for stuff like, all oh, right, I'll just get my phone. All oh, right, so make it right, visible, okay, yeah. yeah. So if this is outside of your play area, mm. you can put your head outside of the play area and see the world in right. 3D as opposed to just one like video. Yeah, because it means difficult. Because your hand, your hand, your hand will be off. Yeah, yeah, it does. It where it is. Yeah. yeah. So, so that's good. That's actually a good, good thing. So you got that, and you've also they've also announced this is, doesn't come with it. You buy it separately. It also announced Vive wireless adapter. That wireless adapter also works with the old version of Vive as well. I did, oh, right, I did read yeah. That, yeah. So. yeah, I think you might be right with that. Um, what, what is that? I've got the impression it's something you put on to it. Well, and you've got you a shit ton of wires. Of, is it a battery? It's basically a battery pack. I think it clips onto your belt. Right, okay. Right, so you've, you've just got a belt battery pack with with um, with wireless and then you've got mm. another box. So, I mean, we, we played Vive, haven't we? And we stood up and, and you consciously aware of this wire down your back so when you're moving around you're like yeah i know there's a you wire you feel like you're gonna right. trip up sometimes yeah sometimes depending how fast everything is mm. so that's good that's so that's yeah good. you've got Pretty the good. cash i don't know how much it is they didn't well, say well mr chris fishwick says um he'll be very surprised if it's below a grand i would be as well well iphones are grand yeah but you get it on subscription you don't get you get VR on subscription. You can just buy an iPhone. You can do, yeah, but everybody gets, majority of people get the phone. What, do you not have a grand? Weirdos. No, fucking <laughs> hell, you sound like a solicitor. It's going to cost you five grand, Mr. Hughes. Mm. Uh, yeah. Sexual harassment. You have to get one. <sighs> yeah, I know. I hated being touched in that way. That's why oh, yeah. I'm suing her. There's a lot of women popping up at news sexually harassing people, and I just think, just calm down, will you? Just. Stop it. You know. Yeah, they're, they're violent. Women are violent. Just want to work. Um, Women are more violent than men. Well, yeah, I know that. That's, that's, that's just, just yeah. how it is. They like puppies because they're small. They'll bite you and it don't really hurt. So you just let them. But it, but it irritates you and you get. It does uh, when they're poking your eyes out. And, and then, <laughs> like, women are more violent than men. It's just that the police aren't going to turn up and arrest a woman. Well, that'd be sexist. Sexual discrimination. It would be, yeah. And, um, well, you know, obviously. Sexual harassment. Well, that's you're touching them, see? That's it. Handcuffs. Well, the, well, why aren't the third wave feminists all kicking off? But we want to be arrested too. Why don't you take us seriously when we're assaulting someone? Well, some you never have that, do you? Some, there's different types of feminists. There's the ones that say, never hit a woman. And then there's the ones that say, well, I'm equal to you. Fucking hit me. I'll let you bite. I don't know. Just, mm. just don't hit anybody. <laughs> Yeah. Stop mental. hitting people. Stop hitting people. Stop hitting people. Star Citizen crowd crowdfunded another thirty five million dollars in twenty seventeen. They are this is just gonna be the most expensive game ever. Uh total, How many? hundred and sorry, thirty five million in twenty seventeen, but the total that yeah. they've accumulated so far for Star Citizen mm -hmm. is hundred and seventy six million dollars that's not quite as much as uh max Payne three how much was that i think that was 300 million wow yeah and everyone was fucking ridiculously expensive ridiculously expensive. well they might get there but but i'm pretty sure that max Payne three was gta engine as well basically they made the gta engine out of and they just made that game in it so yeah, they were yeah. making the engine at the time so when somebody asked how much it cost they went well it cost about 300 million yeah. Uh, uh, so it was like, yeah, not the true but it's cost. not the game, though, is it? You you you're gonna make three, four games out of that engine. Yeah. So, yeah. And you're gonna make a fuck ton of money from it. So they made that. They made GTA Fifth, 
and uh, obviously making Red Dead. Do you know the more I watch the trailer of Red Dead? Because I've tried every now and again and dip back in, and that trailer left me cold. No, it did with me, uh, yeah. I was just like, oh, Red Dead, cool. Yeah. But the trailer didn't do it out. And then I watched the trailer again, and I'm like, every time I watch it, I think, I hope I don't have to play as that guy. Because he's a cunt. He's actually not a likable cunt in the trailer. You know, he's, he doesn't seem... Well, uh, obviously, there's this redemption aspect of it and stuff, but they may do a thing that they did with GTA Five where he plays multiple characters, but but that one character... I like that, because I'd like to play as Trevor's great, great granddad or whatever it would be. Mm. I also want to play as an actual lawman, a proper yeah, lawman. be on the other side. Actual good guy. That'd be a good way to do it, yeah. So you've got you being like whatever you're doing... Not necessarily a bad guy, but maybe you're just in a bad situation. Mm. You've just got to do this shit, and then you've got to go, you've got the law side, and you flip over to them. You'll be really good, yeah, because the, the narrative the narrative should good bring together, and yeah. a bit like GTA, where you can change right at the end, like so pick who you want to be. Then. Yeah, so yeah. You pick your ending. Or you got to kill that guy that was a bad guy, but he's fucking he's doing all right. Or this guy is yeah. good. He's been like good. You get a bit of a through. moral quandary like, going yeah, on. Yeah, and then they'll put this that main character from the advert in. I was killing. Yeah, he's a dog. Get rid of the dick. He was like like I say he wasn't he wasn't. He didn't have any kind of charisma like, like Trevor did. Trevor was madness. Trevor is basically, if they made an, an 18 rated 18 movie, mm. Trevor is Murdoch. Murdoch, yeah. Yeah, he's Murdoch, yeah. Oh, yeah, do that. Do that. Uh, Halo TV show is still in very active development. That's Spielberg's doing that. So that's We're, still happening. Forgot about that. Yeah, they did, they did, did, did one. They did one with Spartan Lock. Yeah, well, they did that. There was uh, oh, fuck, I can't remember. This must be else. Nightfall or some shit like Maybe that. Maybe it's a Netflix original. Uh, I don't Rid know. Ridley Scott had something to do with that. I keep playing with my balls. You can't see them. Can well, this is Spielberg doing something. It's still happening. Does anybody give a fuck about Halo anymore? I, I don't. Halo Five it. murdered it for me. Halo Five Honestly, killed it. I'm fucking. Ki- I mean, number four was. Uh, Synchroning on the edge. They'll get it next time. Uh, when it? Reach was really good, and then yeah. like Halo Five came out. It was fucking shit. Switch is the fastest selling console ever in the US. That's happening. You know, you know something. You know something. When I was doing the review for uh, Wolfenstein Two, I'll punch you on my games. The code UK, written by myself, so it's very inconsistent. Um, I then have a look at who published it and all this kind of stuff, just to give you some like bit of breakdown information. Publisher, developer, how many players? Da, 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 da. On what console? It. On what console it's on? It's on Switch. Yeah. I'm like. Well, it's I'm, not on Switch yet. It will yeah, be. But it's coming out on yeah. Switch, and I'm like, this year. That's, that's actually quite that's impressive. So they've yeah. got Doom. That's all right. Okay, Doom's not meant to look as good as the other ones, but when you're playing it's, it like it's that, it's a competent port. Apparently. Yeah, 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 apparently so. Uh, so. And yeah. ha- after borrowing yours to do a review of Overblade, mm-hmm. it was nice sitting on my sofa, playing mm-hmm. it on the TV, and going, I'm a bit tired, but I'm not... There's, there's a weird thing when you're tired and you, you sit in your living room, because you're like, nah, I'm a bit tired, I'd like to carry on gaming, but I know I have to turn the TV off, console off, this off, mm-hmm. get, you shut the house down. With the switch, it's ace because you're like, well, turn the house down. Turn the house off, turn the switch, go to bed. Right, we've got half an hour on this. Uh, You don't have a house off button that you can just press? Um, I usually just kick my cat. Mm. Well, that's no to do with it, though. And then leave all the electrics on. (laughs) Yeah. So. And then uh, sexual misconduct, IGN, sexual misconduct, the guys that. Quantic dream. Doing become human, destroy it, and. Yeah. Quantic sexual dream. misconduct, sexual misconduct, and uh, sexual misconduct. Show me again, sexual misconduct. Show I kept, sexual getting, misconduct. I kept getting my ass touched on Saturday night. And that's that, but on, on continue. The, we'll find out what happened on here the stream. first. Yeah, on the stream, I was streaming, and somebody just kept running past me. Like, both cheeks, like, dum, dum, dum. I'm like, and if you watch the stream, I'm pretty sure I got caught, like, why? What, who's touched my ass? I turned around. And there was a kid that kept running past the kid. This because obviously it's family. It's a family event. Thing. He's an adult uh, file. And and he just kept running past him. And went, I'm like, what the fuck? This is weird. <laughs> this is how do I react to this? <laughs> how do I react to this? Shoot yourself. You've done it before. So uh, do it again. Hit me with a random, a random, <laughs> a random, a random fact item. Oh, we got the fact. Yeah, gamers edition. Facts. What's this? 
This was uh, my uh, secret Satan Santa. Show, show me Santa, secret Santa from secret mystery Santa. person number six. So what is it? Gamers edition, ultimate guide to gaming. Guinness World, uh, Guinness World Records. Okay, so we're doing a we we'll probably do this every week. Yeah, you know, just until we get bored. Pick a random one, ideally. Okay. The shittest one on the on the thing. Okay. Okay. Some <laughs> most Twitch followers for a horse. Oh, yeah. oh, yeah. we'll, we'll get there one. eventually. We'll pick another one. Spider Man. What about Spider Man? Yeah, Spider Man. We all like Spider Man. He's a Spider Man. Uh, most watched Spider Man gaming video. Okay. Uh, yeah. That's good. Okay, the curious Disney card Pixar Spider Man nursery rhymes and Lightning McQueen USA songs for children with action. Had been viewed ninety thousand times on YouTube. There we have it. There we go. That's 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 your random fact for today. There no, we it's go. something to do with GTA. Something to do with GTA. Yeah, yeah it was, it's probably a mod. Um, Maybe so, I'll look through them next time and try and find something interesting. Let's do what the fuck. Have you been playing, Mr. Garstein? Played quite a few things, so I'm not going to go into them all. Um, well, I'll tell you what I played actually. Tell you what you want. What Over you really, Christmas, really want. I played a lot. I played Zelda DLC two. That happened. Judgment Day. That's what I'll talk about. Uh, Resident Evil Seven. I got the gold, gold edition, so I played through that again. Played through the DLC. I'll talk about that next week, maybe. Uh, Wolf Among Us. I've been playing through that slowly. Just an episode. Where, where about so you're on that? I think I'm up to an episode. Right, okay. Maybe I've just done it. I can't remember. Yeah, right, okay. So uh, you, you and Dragon the Quest Builders for the Switch as a demo on it. Uh -huh. So I wanted to buy it after I played it, and I'm like, oh, it's not out yet. Fuck's sake. It's, I don't like it. Anyway, talk about that another time. So, Zelda DLC 2. Quite liked it. I just wrote a few notes. Because oh, no, okay, yeah, this we... was the first one I played fucking ages ago. <laughs> Barely remember it. So I've had to remind myself. Um, it's all right, yeah. There's some, there's some very, there's some very goodness, and then there's some. Very I goodness. was kind of expecting something else. Fighting. A fight, maybe. Uh, so what I did first, the okay. Zelda, just more Zelda in the Zelda world, okay. which is good. Which is it's nice. a good base game. It's nice. So an excuse to go back to the base game mm -hmm. again because there was DLC one. Dropping the base game, which I enjoyed with the Master Sword yeah. quest thing where you mm -hmm. do the trials. Tower, yeah. Uh, that was good, and the extra armor. So they got more extra armor in this one. Mm. So first job, find all that. Right. So that feels like a chore, but with little rewards everywhere. Mm. So I went on a little mystery tour, mystery hunt, trying to follow these cryptic clues to find the armor. The armor's quite cool. Well, I quite like some of it. It looks um, like me. I cheated on a couple, because there's a fucking limit. It's too big. It's like, fucking hell. Uh, but the, this horse armor, guardian horse armor, that's fucking Clippity clop armor. It just looks beautiful. Armor for clippity clop. Yeah, it gives your horse a bit of extra bump. So you can do that. That's good. That's all. That, that's a plus. Yeah, that's just shitty collecting. Good stuff. Nice. Then I thought, right, I'll get into get into the meat of it now. The meat of the action. So the crux of the biscuit. I, I wasn't keen on this bit. Ah. And you go back to. I mean, all this isn't really spoilers because it's it's in the trailer. You kill Ganon again. Yeah, I'm not going to do any spoilers. You do this. It, you do this before you fight the boss. So, oh. whenever you fight the boss, it takes you back to last save, mm. which was before the boss. So right. Okay. You never finish it, really. You just right, you get yeah, the ending, but yeah. you're always thrown back into the world. Right. Okay. Um, so you, you go back to your thing and so, to where you were first start of the game, and there's some shit happens, and there's a there's a fucking weapon in there. It shows it on the trailer. A weird looking thing, and uh, it's like a one hit weapon. You kill everything with one hit. You don't keep this permanently. Mm. It just sort of puts you back on the plateau, and you've got to do. You've got to kill dickheads that are there. The trouble is with this one hit knobhead, it makes you one hit as well. Oh, so right. your heart just goes yeah. to fucking nuts, yeah. bollock of a heart. So I thought, okay, this is going to be hard and irritating, possibly. Mm. So I went around, twatted everything. Uh, no, first thing I did was thought I'd cheat. I know where I was eating food, and it didn't give me any health. Right. You always go back to nothing. This is whenever you got this weapon, which is all the time, because you've mm. got to do this area first. So I thought I'll go to sleep. I know where a bed is. That didn't work. Went to sleep. Filled myself up. I'm like, men. And yeah, then I woke up. Vroom, fuck. So I tried to cheat. But um, yeah, it's quite good. There's four shrines in that area. 
they're very good, apart from one, which is a spiky one. You go in the shrines, you've got one health, so it's sort of designed that way, where it's hard. Right. If okay. you get it, you've got to do it. And there was a spiky one that was just shit, so I weren't asked about that. But the rest of them were very good. Then it takes the weapon off you, and then you just go on a mission, a treasure hunt to um, to find basically the other shrines. Um, and they give you more memories, so it's the four areas, the four beastie knobheads. Go to them, and um, you, there's all this cryptic shit, and he shows you a picture of somewhere to go to start some shit and find this shrine. I wasn't so keen on that. Mm. It was like a treasure hunt thing again. Oh, fuck this, but I did it anyway. And the shrine, all of them were very good. They were like top tier shrines I was really enjoying. The shrines, I just wasn't enjoying getting to the fucking right, things. They okay. didn't, it wasn't that fun. It was nice to wander around the world again, but that was shit. So, yeah, four of them. And then when you, whenever you've done the shrine, then you have to go and fight a fucking boss again that you've already fought. But they give you a sort of scenario that's fucking... Uh, he's hard. You've only got so many arrows. They've slightly changed the situation, and you've got to kill him. It's hard as fuck. But if you've got your electricity power thing, make sure that's powered up. Twat them with that. And then that boosts some shit. I don't know. That were a bit shit. So far, the shrines are good. Everything out and the treasure. You know, yeah, the, yeah, the treasure, armor, yeah, the yeah. armor. That's yeah. good. Um, and but you get little bits of memories, so you get more story. I suppose that's all right. Um, but what was very cool actually, the is there's another dungeon. So that I, I whenever I say dungeon, I mean the divine beasts. Mm. So. Oh. I just didn't really know that, even though it sort of says it in the DLC <coughs> thing. There's a whole other dungeon, and I don't really like the Divine Beast. I don't think they're very good inside. I like walking out, but a bit of shit. But this dungeon is fucking ace. Right, okay. His design and my brain was clicking, going, ah, oh, it was hard, I get stuck. But it just felt right. It felt very Zelda. Right, was okay. like, oh, that was fucking brilliant. So far, four eight, shrines. Eight shrines. Eight shrines. They're all good. Yeah, they were the first four. Oh, the were first like DLC. One hit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What? No, no. In oh, no, DLC yeah, the first two. four were yeah, yeah. first four were one hit ones. Yeah, yeah. And the spike one was shit, but the rest were good. And the second four would find the fuckers, and they were just like normal, but they were very good. The, and then the divine beast. was... The divine yes. beast. Well, it's just a dungeon, really. Not so much a beast, but it's cool. Yeah, very cool. It's still got the inner workings, and you still do similar things. But oh yeah, that was a very good dungeon. And then he's also got like. A fucking different fucking boss that I'll not spoil, but I was like, fuck! I was not expecting this. Bowser! This is awesome. Bowser. It felt like one of them Mario moments, Mario Odyssey moments, where I was like, wow, I just wasn't expecting. Oh, cool as fuck. Oh my god. I was like, that playing it. Dark Link. Shook, brilliant. Brilliant. Loved it. Not as cool as that, though, but still, no, no, no. I was still very impressed. I was like, this can't be happening. No, no, you're not doing that. You are doing that. This is happening. Brilliant. Very much enjoyed that. Then you get the bike, which is shown in the trailer, which um, was uh, quite. It's good to piss around with, but yeah, I mean, you finished it by then, so you're just driving around on a fucking bike, and there's no real reason to do it. But I had some fun with it, drove around. I think. The was it not jarring, though? No, I thought like, as, as far as like aesthetics, like, why have I got a bike? I suppose maybe slightly, but I think when you've. By this point, Young and fuck you've like. twatted the game. Yeah, I suppose, yeah. Because you've done all the DLC, you've had to do the Divine Beast, so you can't do this DLC, you can't start playing it. And you, oh, so, so you've ha you have to finish it to get to these? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, you right, you okay. can't you do this DLC until you've finished all the Divine Beasts, and you don't need to kill Ganon. That's actually alright, though. I, I like that, I like that, as, yeah. far, as, as far as DLC is concerned. It's not like a sideline over here. It's not a matter of, like, yeah. you, know, you know, I know you've just bought this game, but why don't you buy this DLC, like, mm. as well? It's like, well, there's, there's no gotta point. Fin there's no gotta fucking point. Game, yeah. Finish the game. Yeah. Finish, finish the game. And if you don't finish the game in the first two weeks and you're going to trade it in, you haven't spent any money on DLC. Yeah. It's a waste of your fucking time. Yeah. yeah. No, that's quite good. Yeah, it was all right. I don't mind that. Um, so the bike, yeah, it's all right. You're just you're dicking around at that point. So I just had a bit of fun with it and then put it to bed. Um, but I don't like the engine sound. It's not loud enough. I mean, it's yeah. got like, boom, 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 whack, but it doesn't have that. Grunt. It doesn't have the balls. It's one of them where when you're at top speed, it's sort of going, eh, and it sounds like a scooter or something really irritating. Don't know. So, yeah, there's good and bad there. So the four, the, the eight temples, seven, uh, the eight shrines, seven of them were very good. They mm. were like top tier, I think. Even the one heart jobs, um, you know, one hit jobs, mm. they were they were very good. And the dungeon, very good. Uh, and and the, the boss, very good. But 
the unit of the arm are very good. The bits in between, just a bit. Uh, the mm. weapon, the one hit weapon, it was all a bit in there. So, so that was Zelda. That's what I think of it. Give it a 6.5. Still think it's worth getting. Because with the DLC, you get. You have to buy a DLC, or all of it, like pack one and pack two, it just all comes together at 18 quid. If you enjoyed it to the point where you finished the game... And you want more? You, you go around the world again, so it's mm. just more Zelda. And How many hours did it take to do them, Bob? Don't know, actually. Should have checked that. It's a fair chunk of time, because you're running around a lot, like just treasure hunting mm. for a lot of it. The shrines are as long as the shrine is. All yeah, that's, depend. all that's, that's kind dependent of, of, on yeah. you, you, you as a character. So the rest of it just depends how lost you get or how quick you are at finding something or oh, how much yeah. you use Google. I mm. used it a couple of times because it was fucking irritating. Yeah, but I mean, can you give a ballpark figure for for time? I honestly have no idea. I get lost in Zelda. Because um, right. I'm doing it on Switch, I'm just sort of chilling. Just, right, right, okay. I honestly couldn't... Right, I'm, fair no enough. idea... Could have been 10 hours, could have been 30 hours. Well, no, no. It no, felt no. like a substantial amount of time. Right, no, no, that's good. Know. No, no, that's I'll just fair. say 30. Who right. knows? Don't even know. Okay, yeah, <laughs> no, that's uh, good. That's all. Yeah, that's so that's that. Witcher style. So, what the fuck have you. Yeah, but unlike Witcher, I think that's what people were expecting. Do you know how Witcher had a whole new fucking area? No, only least. on that one. On that one, on one. That one. But one. I think that's what people were expecting on this DLC. No, no, no. I think they were expecting, like, maybe a new island or something. Just somewhere that's over here. Yeah, no, I, you see, I... You know what I mean? I, I undermined it, it. I think that's what people... Even, even what though I wanted. hadn't played it, I wasn't expecting them to do yeah, that anyway. I kind of had, had a little hope. But it's good that we get more shrines yeah. and, a, and a brilliant dungeon and a, a great, nice, surprising boss and extra armor. So, you know, it's DLC it. one, it's you've it. got other shrines as well, haven't you? No, you don't have shrines. No, you, just, you have just have the have tower, the, Master Sword Tower. Yeah, which yeah. I very much enjoyed. Yeah, yeah, I'm probably saying, yeah. And more armor. So what the fuck have you been playing, Mr. Hughes? was I playing PUBG... Player Unknown Battleground on the last episode, I can't remember. No, I don't think I had. Um, so. Long time ago. Mr. Chris! Fucking year ago, man. Mr. P- yes, it was. It was on home number a day ago. Um, Mr. Chris Billsborough bought Player Unknown Battleground. Okay. Uh, which meant. Apparently it's a bit glitchy bitchy or something. I'm not asked about the glitchy, I know it's because it's early access. Um, Seems like one of them sort of games, anyway. Early access. Don't you drop like. off, uh, you land. And uh, there's 100 people on a map. You can play it single player, you can play it two player, you can play it four player. I watched a bit of someone playing right. it. Uh, you get dropped off, <whistles> parachute out, land, you go into buildings, you have to try and find some guns, helmets, blah, 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 blah. and then you've got a, an area on the map, a circle on the map that mm. you want to get into within the next five minutes. Anything outside right. that? It's what slowly happens? this, this blue line will come in. You start losing health, or do you just and die? If that blue line gets in front of you, Right. As it goes to the 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 white lines, mm. once it gets the white line, it stops. And you got another five minutes, and then it'll change the size of the area. And you got five minutes to get into that next new area. So, so it's, it's bringing everyone thing. together. Tries to bring everybody together. So well, it does bring everybody together. But what happens when you're outside of it? Does it kill it you? It starts killing you. It starts killing your health. Your health, your health goes health down. Drains. Your yeah, right. yeah. Your health okay. drains. Um, so. You jump in, yeah, look at this, mm, yeah, it's sexy, this is nice, oh, it looks shit, it's okay, it looks shit, there's 100 people, and we're playing online, it doesn't matter. I accept that, yeah. it's alright, so, pottering around, this, that, and the other, wandering around, yeah, I'm in top 10, okay, 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 okay. alright, I think I've got this sussed, and my thing was, I'm not asked about winning the match. Mm. Let me get into top ten. Yeah. Uh, that's not bad at all, is it? That's not bad at all. Oh, mm. hundred, fucking brilliant, right? So what I did, my my mission was always get a backpack, so you can carry some shit, and get a gun. Don't fucking matter, mm. right? And then get inside that white circle, and I'd do it, and I'd get into top ten every single time, top five every. Three or four times, you know. Were, were there much action in getting to that stage? Did you see a lot of people, or were it just <coughs> were you hiding a lot? I mean, what? it depends on how you want to play it. If you, <coughs> you see, the thing is, it's like gunplay. Well, what was happening to you though? What to get to the to top ten, what, what was happening? Were you hiding, or were well, you? I hiding. I was crawling through grass. I don't right. mind me. I'd like taking my time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, which is where my bug burst starts happening with the game. Okay. It, that circle. Going get here, get here, get here, get here, get here, mm-hmm. means that a match lasts about 15 minutes, unless you get shot straight away. Alright, I thought it longer than that. No, right. it's about 15 minutes, 15 minutes, 20 minutes. And that's not long enough for me. 
Yeah, I was expecting like an hour or so, to be honest. And I don't know why. The options for the game are single player, two player co op, four player mm. teams. And I personally would like a hundred people get drops on the map and it's last man standing. No circle to tell you to go somewhere. Mm. But every ten minutes, for two or three minutes, everybody appears on the map. Oh right, so right? you know where they are. So yeah. it's like oh shit, Highlighted. right, okay, right. Mm. Um Yeah, that's it, it, it'll last, like a different it, mode. Yeah. It'll last about two fucking hours sometimes, but I'd like that because it'd be like, right, I'll go and get me shit and get me equipment. Make all your items sparer. Make make a much burst you know, uh, sparse, much more sparse. Right? And Right, okay. Mm. Right, and then I, I played that because I got bored. I got I got bored, I got fed up. So you I got played... bored because it was too quick, not I... because it was too long. I got bored. Because I... you want to sort of... Well, no, I, it's... I wouldn't mind if it was just too quick, but I wouldn't mind other options. Yeah. So, playing it on my own, top ten all time, when I was playing it with Mr. Chris Billsborough, I already said, um, we... We sort of just landed and we we're like, oh, let's try up here. And I said, like, oh, well, yeah, it's okay. We got loads of equipment one time and some knobhead pinned us down. Mm. Like, <laughs> pinned us down and we're like, I need to get over this fucking hill to get in this white circle. Right. This guy's not hitting us, but if we get up, we're going to die. Mm. And if we. So That's I, his plan. I ended up. Ru- yeah, but he's going to die. All right. Where's well, an idiot? Right, so, <laughs> so I like, was pinned, and I'm like, for fuck's sake! So I ran into the building. Like Chris laid some fire down. I ran into the building to go upstairs. Got upstairs. He was up on the higher floor, and then I see the big blue wine coming towards. Like, oh shit! Here we go. So I jumped over this wall, and we we're both fucking legging it down this field. And this guy. So we're legging it down the field, like da 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 da. Upside right? down. There's a guy here, right, going. <laughs> The blue line goes past the guy that's here shooting at us. So he's currently dying. Mm. He's still having to do with us. Yeah. We run, 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 we run. And the boyfriend kills us. And it was just like, the amount of times you occasionally die. I know, well, like I said, like I said top 10, regularly. Only if I go backpack, gun, let me fuck off. Mm. Right? There's no fun to that. So the only other way of doing it is to drop when everybody, because you choose when you jump out of the plane. And the plane flies across the island and you choose to jump out. Right. Right. So you choose your drop off point. You basically. choose your drop off point. The circles are random. Completely random. Oh, right. right? Uh, so the only way you can get going is if you jump out right at the beginning when everybody's fucking parachuting in. And then it's like, go be gone, bah, bah, come back, and you can just be dead straight away. Yeah. And, and the thing is, is like, no, oh, I don't know. Um, Some, I was playing it because I didn't pay for it. Chris Chris Bills prepared for it. He uh, Chris paid for it. I don't want to say his full name. Uh, Chris Chris paid for it. I was playing it. And I'm like, I'm getting a bit fed up with this. And I was playing it with him one time when we, I think, we were on a tenth match or some shit like that on one one evening. We played it for a few nights. Tenth match, and he went, I don't like this game. I'm like, thank fuck you <laughs> said it. Thank fuck you said it. I'd sound like an ungrateful cunt yeah. if I said yeah, it. I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm not the biggest fan. It needs other game modes. It needs other Well, it's early access, you say. It's time. It's time. Yeah, it's time. Fucking time. Uh, Everybody's Ar- playing it. Ark was in early it's got access more for two than, years. Than anything in the than world. Sliced ever. Bread. Uh, so I'll play that. And then, then uh, Mr. Chris sent me a message at work going, have you seen Hunter Call of the Wild? I'm like, well, yeah, I fancied that oh, for yeah. a while. I played but, that earlier. But I don't... What it was? Play it on the didn't I? Yeah, he did, yeah. That's no, no, that's just what I think everything yeah. is. <laughs> but, uh, so he sent me a message saying, have you have you, uh, have you heard of this? I'm like, yeah, I've been looking at it for a while. Because mm-hmm. I like my hunting games, but Cabela hunting games were shit because they started adding stories to it and started making it like a oh, fucking action shooter. It's like, no, I want to just walk across fields. I want to use... Co- I want to be like... A lighter. You have a, you have a, you have like moose calls and deer right. calls. Like, <laughs> and like, just wait. <laughs> and you hear them shouting. You're like, right, they're there. <laughs> and you're right. And, and, and like, the thing is, is so I spoke to him about. It, and he was like, no, no, I like my hunting games. So we get it. It's up to nine players online. Right. And you can go around. You've got two maps. You've got one which is based in Europe, 
So we've got European animals. So you've got European bison. You've got a red stag. Uh, well, red deer, roe deer, um, fallow deer, red fox, and wild boar. Cats. And it's fucking dogs. massive. You've got cats, dogs, oh my. <laughs> but you've got a huge fucking map. An absolutely huge fucking map. Right, yeah. Massive. It took us three quarter of an hour to an hour to walk halfway up the map. Mm. That's a fucking big game map to walk, walk that What far. happens when you get to the edge? Well, it sort of says, like, well, they, that's the end of the hunting area because, you know, they'll shoot beyond yeah, that. Yeah, right? yeah. So it's, it's okay. Uh, the lighting effect is fucking fantastic. Go out there and hunt people. When you shoot, when you shoot um, you've got an area of where you've just made all your fucking noise. You have to fucking crouch, you have to sneak hide behind trees. And if you hid behind a tree, if you stood up and you stood behind a tree and you're aiming, then you're not going to be fucking seen. That's yeah. good. Unlike. Horizon Zero Dawn, yeah. and then you've got another map which is based in America. So you, so you, so you've got elk, you've got moose, you've got uh, black bear, um, coyotes, uh, white and black tailed deer, and it's just that map yeah. is equal to the size of the other map. It's just right. fucking huge. Is it good though? Are you enjoying it? It's fucking amazing. Right. It is the most chill. We can see all the tracks and stuff. Ever. Check, yeah, so check the shit. Check you, can, the you can actually turn them off. Right? So, so if you don't. want to go hardcore. Yeah, because the tracks are actually there. And you will see. Well, they're sort of illuminous when you. Yeah, they, they glow. illuminate. They glow up and you walk over. And if you find one, you press your A to track that track. And, on, and any those tracks then turn blue. So you'll know that that's that one creature. But you can switch you can that off and that's hardcore. But you can switch that shit off because. Might be too hard, that. Because you can see grass. Alright? There's grass. Yeah. And if a deer has recently gone through it, oh yeah, cool. Right, and there'll be tracks, and you can tell by the foot where, track, where it's mm. going, which direction it's going. And if the grass is slightly up, it means that it was a long time ago. And if, oh right. right cool. and, and you can, you, so you can technically Do track it. these motherfuckers normally. Yeah. Mm. And uh, so when I first started playing it, and and I shot a I shot a deer. Uh, I hit it, it went down because they, they just basically set you up on each on both of the maps, depending on which map you choose to start on. Each one of them starts you off in a starting area, and each one of them gives you a deer. Right? There's a deer, come fucking shoot his face off. Um, when I first shot it, dropped it, went over, I'm like, mm, I, f I, want, I want a hole where I've hit the fucking thing. Right. I want a bit of gore and this. Yeah. But more and more I play it, and it, it's a conscious decision. No, we're not putting that gore there. There's no fucking need because once you, once you claim that deer, it shows like an X-ray of the deer mm. and where the bullet went and okay. how deep it went in. All right, okay. So, so you're getting some sort of feedback. Yeah, yeah, some feedback. So we'll tell you whether you burst its lung, whether you got its heart, or whether you hit its spleen, or whether where you shattered its spine. You don't, or you don't want them to suffer. You don't. You want, want them, to, them to die. And there's two reasons. So, so there's a but game. There's the gamification of of not wanting them to suffer because if you shoot them, they'll bleed. So you have to go out and you find a blood track and you can chase them. Now I chased an animal that I shot. It were a fucking big ass moose. They were only bleeding lightly. I followed it for an hour and a half. Sexist. Looking, Fattest. Looking for, uh, looking for its bloodline, following its tracks. And I finally found it. And it was like, fucking hour, an hour and a half, man. That was poor shot placement. Mm. So it, it feels good when you hit that deer from a range and it just goes Kill it down. Quick, yeah. It's dead. Yeah. So it's, it's, it's good. And, and when you play it online with somebody, there's no competition between you. You're just hunting. Because, You're not hunting together. Well, Chris doesn't take any of his calls with him. I take all my calls with me like, quick, 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 for a uh, roe deer not, and stuff like that. Why would you not take them? He doesn't take them so he's lighter so he can move a little oh, bit I see, quicker. Okay. Yeah. But I take them because like sometimes I'll hear them in distance and I can like, I, I'm fine. On this game, I am so fucking chilled. I am happy, led there, pissing it down because the rain effect, the lighting effects through the trees are brilliant. It's a it beautiful world. Good, yeah. uh, there is some like glitches where you've got like rocks doing Horizon Zero Dawn thing, floating above and all that kind of shit but it, it's really pretty there's very little to interact with because you're there hunting so he's like this is what you're doing you're hunting yeah, so you're yeah. Rubbish, around. Uh, you can get sense. can you swim uh, no no you can't swim because of all the shit that you've got on your back and <laughs> you just wouldn't swim, you just swim when you're hunting you just wouldn't swim when you're hunting but it's really fucking good so good it's going to sound like a bizarre fucking thing to say I was playing it one Friday night with Chris I think we were playing it from off nine, it got to off four in the morning, and I was just chilling behind this tree. Worker, worker, worker. <laughs> right, chilling, chilling. 
Fall asleep, shoot yourself like dead. Well, and I fell asleep. I, and I fell asleep, and the thing is, I woke up like about six in the morning, went, oh fuck, turned my Xbox off, and Chris sent me a message later on going, you make unusual noise when you sleep. Well, that funny motherfucker, <laughs> we were stalking at night time in the game. Night time? Stalking. Chris, man, have you seen that? Have you seen that foul deer over there, man? It's a, it's a male, I think you've probably got a better angle. Chris? <laughs> Chris? It's so good it'll send you I'll to take sleep. It. I'll take it. No, it's bizarre. It's, it's just because you're chilling and you're just it's there. It's so chill. You when, when I'm playing it on my own, uh, I often just, like, because you can get an, an ATV, right? So when you go to these outposts, then the more you use a rifle, you get rifle experience. The higher the rifle experience you get, the the higher caliber rifles you can unlock. Okay. You've got shotguns as well you can use, which... Shotgun works, a rabbit works on the same same mechanic. The more you, times you kill something with a shotgun, the more experience. A rabbit. I find the smallest animal I can. You don't get anything shotgun. for rabbits. You don't get anything uh, for rabbits. What's the smallest animal I can kill with a shotgun? Uh, red fox. Um, red fo I'll blow its fucking so, body off. And and there's pistols and then there's um, can you go bow and arrow. Something? I shot a a bison with a bow and arrow crept up on the motherfucker. Can you shoot him in the dick? Yeah. Do they yeah. have a dick? Well, you can get different ammunition. Dick ammunition. <laughs> you get different, different, <laughs> different ammunition for your for, for your guns. So you have like soft points. So what happens with a, a bullet when it when it gets shot? I'll put it that way around because it'll be easier. They call it mushrooming. Okay. So it'll hit the target, mm. and because it's soft lead, it'll bloom out like that. Right. Which means it does massive internal damage, meaning massive bleeding, which will put your animal down. But the trouble is, is if it's hitting flesh. Mm. Then it'll be mushrooming before it gets to anything lethal. All right. So you can then get uh, ammunition which has less mushrooming, less compression and com impact, mm. but more penetration. Penetration. Right. So I have these special tip rounds, and there has been several animals where I have butt weeded them because all ah. you see is their asshole, and I'm like, taking it. And then <laughs> if it's a small animal, you. Because the x-ray shows how deep the bullet went in. It's like, right, it tested, it tested, it tested his lung heart. It's like, right, through its asshole. In your ass. Yeah, so, so I've been playing that. It's really, really So good. what's that called again? That's called Hunter Call of the Wild. I'm doing a review at the moment. Oh, I Get also that, played some weed. Uh, Wolfenstein 2. There's a re review up yeah, of that. I think we've talked about Wolfenstein before. Have we? Did we? Four weeks ago. Save it yeah, for next yeah, time. Yeah. No, no, we did a bit. Yeah, we did a bit. Save yeah, that for next time. time. Right, so let's check out the voices of the people. So the people's on the Facebook groups. On the groups of the people's. Join that, it's on Facebook. Chat shit. Talk about games. Vote. Show me games awards. Can win a few of them up. Yeah. Slowly but surely. Things are winning. Out. Slowly but surely. Every few days. So uh, let me get this shit. Scary question. But it's on PC as well. <laughs> Console exclusive. It used to mean, still does. Console exclusive. Right, so here we are in the group. Uh, Chris Broderick. Everybody just fuck off. Oh God. Right. See so what you've done, everybody. Everybody. This is what you've done. Right. Can I close that, please? Oh no. There we go. Right. So Chris Broderick. Oh. <laughs> is this new? Facebook's oh. updated, so maybe we've got some new stuff. Oh yeah, Facebook's updated, so it's worse <laughs> than it ever was before. Fucking hell, this is good. I'd find way to switch off irritants. You uh, need the like Xbox button. What is it? No fucking do not disturb. It's Facebook. It has to tell you stuff because you need, disturb, need to it? need to need to try. Right, so yeah, main quest, side quest, me side quest. Oh, all well, the laughs. Fuck off! Um, right, okay, so I don't know what that is. It's just going and going. It's just a little game. Going. Just a little game where you just click people off. Right, right what's okay. That? Long shot, but does anybody have a X Rocker gaming chair arms? Alright, okay. It looks like it's made of rubber, like it's a sex toy. What is it? Yeah. Steve Hester, he likes to share lots of stuff. Um, yep, okay. Uh, Rianne Preston, if Dark Souls was animated, this looks top. Let me send this. No. That. It's like Cuphead, but Dark Souls. Oh, fuck. Is, is this a proper. Fox? No, it's just an animation. Oh. <laughs> it, won't, it won't be showing the games unless we had some fucking annoyances, would it? 
Because you start as you mean to go on. Yeah. Happy we've, New Year! We find new problems as we go. This yeah. is just the first of many that yeah, we'll encounter. I'm just moving on. So I'm currently playing through COD games, so we'll move on from COD. Oh, and Chris, Christopher Broderick, otherwise known as the reason we have two posts. <laughs> uh, well, we had two posts anyway. Um, uh, misogyny. Oh, look! Show me. I, I'll let you talk for it. Show me games. Check that out. It's an internet. Thing. dot co dot uk. It's got reviews on and shenanigans. There we <laughs> well, go. Maybe not shenanigans. It's got reviews on it. Xbox original Xbox Duke controller for Xbox One gets price. I might buy one. I might buy one. Oh, the big motherfucker! Yeah. The old school one. Proper one. Proper vibration. Fuck yeah. HD rumble. Just actual power rumble. That's what they should call it. Power have rumble. You, have you seen this end user agreement? Yeah. Oof. I mean, I wonder if anybody's ever read that particular one. I read one. Not, I've not read that or particular any, one, but, but I, that one. I read the one for uh, Connect. Um, Why did I read it? Uh, it went on, on the three hundred and sixty, and that was fucking scary. That's why I got rid of my Connect. I'm gonna sneeze. <sighs> <laughs> um, but yeah, I read that one. It's still going. That's ridiculous. That's absolutely ridiculous. How many, how many minutes does it have on it? Oh, I don't know. Lewis Waddington turned up. I think. Let's have a look. It's one, one minute, 15 seconds of constant scrolling now. Uh, Damien was there. So no. uh, retro Games Night at the Back Cave happened on Saturday. It did happen. Lewis is very witty today. He is very witty today. <laughs> very active, very, very active person. So yeah. Uh, so what? So what, what, so I watched this one yet. Yeah. So Soul Calibur. You can watch that on the YouTube's. It's that really happens. good. Go and have a look at that on the YouTube's. If you don't want to go onto the YouTube's, you can go onto the website. And the website has it there as well. So Show check it out. UK. So you can watch that. Then read a couple of reviews, isn't it? So, well, was that because the new one was announced? Yeah, because the new one's announced. And uh, yeah, so fine games just good, aren't they? It's good. Yeah, they're good for tournaments. So we did that on the arcade cabinet. Oh, brilliant. So, and it was the original arcade board, so Ooh. we were playing proper, proper. Doing it properly. Properly. There you go. Uh, when, when you're in Hawaii, waiting on a ballistic missile, but that missile doesn't, never comes. Oh. It's terrible. I mean, imagine getting that message. Imagine getting a message like that on your phone. You know about the Hawaii thing. I don't Well, that news. actually happens. So, I, I so don't have news. Hawaii, all yeah. people there, they got a text message warning them that there's a ballistic missile inbound. Right. This is not a drill. Everybody got that text message. And the fucking sirens are going off. They've just re-put the sirens up. Um, yeah. And then they got a message 38 minutes later or something like that saying, oh no, I fucked up. Yeah. And what they've done is, they, <laughs> they literally pressed the wrong button. They were gonna just do it like a drill, just right. a test, you know. But they pressed the wrong button. The button that makes it say, this is not a drill, as opposed to, this is we're just testing it or whatever so everyone just shit themselves they're all fucking hiding in dreads and all that so that's what that's referenced to right. if you don't watch the news fallout nuclear that's what that is um and that's uh, it basically because facebook's just crashed on me yeah so that happened facebook went mental didn't so it we can't do an episode of What's that? Oh we're, no! Every year we have to relearn what's happened. What's going on? What new problems are on the Tinto webs? Oh Forget it. My Forget it. It's still in gold. Still, we're Everything's done. broken. Thanks for watching. You know this. This is normal. This is normal behaviour for the Tinto webs. For the for us. This OBS anyway. studio. For OBS studio. Uh, Facebook would be a bit weird to be fair. The Facebook would be weird, but why is my background not? Where it's meant Back to be. Gold. Look, it's there. It's <laughs> Why is it down there? Twelve updates since we last used it. That's bye I'm bye. Doing. Yeah. So well, thanks for watching. Check all that out, and we'll see you in a week on Monday. Maybe we'll fix Facebook. Maybe we'll fix OBS. Maybe we'll fix Erwin. I don't know. I don't know. See you later. Book. <laughs>